How's it going guys? Welcome to my vlog! I kinda had to just be quiet for that part because it was really awesome. Another awesome part. That pretty much went there for, as you can see, a bunch of people from Back to the Future 2. One of my, maybe my favorite movie of all time. I think, if not, it is pretty damn close. I didn't record this video, but I figured I'd try to give you guys something. Chucky. Stranger Things, there's a lot of people there. A lot of people there. Those have eyes. Crypt Keeper. There was a lot of people there. Basket Case. No idea. I don't know everybody there. I pretty much just knew a few people. The people I pretty much named. And comic book men, of course. That show the car gang. It is so awesome. I almost bought this a while ago. I really wanted it. It's fucking awesome. Good thing I didn't. But it's still awesome. So. That was just the badge. Well, not the badge, but the wristband. You're fucked. Really, really, really awesome hats. The map says we're fucked. Very awesome. You guys you might not know it. Ricky Bean Logan. He was in the movie Freddy's Dead. So that's the Freddy slash right there in the front. The Freddy claws. Doing damage. The map says we're fucked. And. Here is the 3D glasses. Supposedly these were from the movie, from the driving. And Ricky Dean Logan was selling them there. Very bad. I had to get it. You guys know I had to get it. He had a few of these there. And I had to get it. So I got it. As he House Party 2. House Party 2. Damn it is old. Really. As I always say, really awesome. He even signed these two. I'm so happy to have these. And there's him from the movie Freddy's Dead. You guys might recognize him. And he was also in Back to the Future 2. Even awesomer. Now you might recognize him. He was in Back to the Future 2 also. Marty McFly's dad in the future. Upside down. It's supposed to be that way. And Back to the Future 1 and 2. Earth Angel. Back to the Future 1 and 2 again. Goldie Wilson. Vote for Goldie. And then Chucky. He actually played the little kid. Good guys. And this is a newspaper I picked up when it first released. I think in 2015. Definitely had to get it. They had another newspaper in California. They only gave it out to people that were at Universal Studios. And bam! Ricky Dean Logan had a few copies. He autographed mine. So happy about this. Also, you bozo. Bozo. I can't speak right now. It's so awesome though. Now these autographs, I got some of these last year. I think it was last November, October, it maybe might have even been August. I have no idea, I can't remember. That I actually got from a nerd box or something like that. But yeah, these are a bunch of my autographs that I had. Figured I'd show you guys. Devil's Rejects, Rob Zombie. I picked up some posters there. You guys gotta know him. Or stickers, decals. Michael Myers, if you guys can't tell. Halloween 1, the first Michael Myers. 
I got, actually got a few pictures of those. Because they... I had to. The original Michael Myers. I had to. Freddy Krueger. Looked pretty awesome. I actually got some other Freddy Krueger posters that I picked up in Universal Studios at City Walk. Gotta show you guys that shit. That shit fucking awesome. Joker. <laughs> Lots of has. So this is my huge, huge poster. Huge. Fucking huge. Huge. I went and I bought this on eBay. And... I looked for the best post that I could find, and this was it. Really awesome. I got a lot more signatures to go. I got all these signatures in one day. But I'm very, 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 very happy to have this, especially autographed by these four guys. It's going to be awesome when I can get more, but it, I'm loving it right now, even if I didn't get any anything else. I'd still be in love with this. One of my favorite movies, if not my favorite movie. So if you guys like the vlog, make sure to like and subscribe.